Welcome everyone, in order to enable personal hotspot in iPhone 14 Pro, the first step is you're going to open up the settings app. From here, you want to scroll all the way down and you should see the personal hotspot menu. If you don't see this option right here, then you're going to tap on mobile data. And from here, you should see personal hotspot. If you still don't see this option, your carrier has disabled personal hotspots in your cellular plan. The solution is to call up the carrier and ask them to enable the personal hotspot feature. Once we have this option, we're going to select personal hotspot and now we're in the hotspot menu. So first of all, if you turn on allow others to join, this will uh, turn on the hotspot itself. Keep in mind, new devices cannot connect to your personal hotspot if you leave this page, okay? So if I go out of personal hotspot, if I wanted the device to connect to the hotspot, they would not see the hotspot. However, if a device is already connected, you can leave the personal hotspot menu and the device will stay connected. On top of this, we have the Wi-Fi password. If you go into here, this will allow you to change the password for your personal hotspot. You also have family sharing. So when this feature is on, the family members will be able to see your hotspot if they're in view right here under the personal hotspot section. If you have asked for approval on, when they try and connect, you will need to approve the connection. If you tap into here, you have automatic and with automatic, they'll be automatically able to connect without asking for any approval or without entering the password. If you have issues where your hotspot isn't showing up, you see here maximize compatibility. You may need to turn this toggle on. This toggle will help solve the issue where your hotspot isn't showing up in another device's settings. So once allow others to join is turned on, it may ask you to turn on Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. Just follow that and turn that on. When you go to the Wi-Fi settings of any device, this can be an iPhone, this can be a you know an Android, Windows, you should see the Wi-Fi network show up right here. Do keep in mind, if this does not show up, the personal hotspot, you must be in the personal hotspot view, number one. Number two, try turning off, allow others to join, turn it back on, and then hopefully your device will show up. Once it shows up, we're just going to select the device. In my case, because I'm on the same iCloud account, I'm not asked to enter in my app, uh, my Wi-Fi password. However, in your case, you may have to enter in the password and you can see the Wi-Fi password for you will be right here. And now we are connected. So you're gonna notice it says no internet connection. That is because I do need to spend money in order to have personal hotspot working. I don't wanna do that. And so that's the reason why there was no internet. But once you are connected, you should be good to go. When a device is connected to your personal hotspot, so I'm gonna reconnect this guy right here. Once you are connected, you can leave the personal hotspot menu and these devices will stay connected. However, if they disconnect for whatever reason, you will need to go back to the personal hotspot menu in order to reconnect them. With that being said, thanks for watching. Check out my Amazon affiliate link. If you buy any product from Amazon with that link, you support the channel. Bye-bye.